morning student this is module 3 partial differential equation first of all we go for the formation of partial differential equation by elimination of arbitrary constant okay so we are going to use some notation here p is equal to dou z by dou x q is equal to dou z by dou y r is equal to dou square z by dou x square s is equal to dou square z by dou x dou y and t is equal to dou square z by dou y square so let us solve the sum problem 2z is equal to x square by a square plus y square by b square so there is a note here if the number of arbitrary constant to be eliminated is equal to number of independent variable in the given relation then we obtain a first order partial differential equation if the number of arbitrary constant to be eliminated is more than the number of independent variable then we get a higher order partial differential equation here only two arbitrary constant and two independent variable so how to eliminate these two arbitrary constant let us see differentiate this with respect to x and y so when you differentiate with respect to x dou z by dou x is equal to differentiation of x square is 2x upon a square and this term get 0 similarly with respect to y 2 dou z by dou y and this term get 0 2y upon b square so dou z by dou y is for q and dou z by dou x notation we are going to use p so 2 2 get cancelled p is equal to x by a square and 2 2 get cancelled q is equal to y by b square equation 2 and this is equation 3 now we have to remove this arbitrary constant for that this equation substitute in the first i'll write the first equation 2z is equal to x square by a square plus y square by b square that is equal to now substitute what is 1 upon a square x square is as it is 1 upon a square is from the equation to p by x and from the equation 3 1 upon b square is q by y so substitute 2z is equal to xp plus y q here xx get cancelled yy get cancelled this is the first order this is required partial differential equation so you can you can solve the second problem as it is first you have to differentiate with respect to x and differentiate with respect to y you will get second and third equation then these two equation you have to substitute in the first equation you will get the partial differential equation 